Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel CAD Tutorials for Beginners. And in this tutorial, we will uh, create a syntax tank, water tank. So let us start with the mechanical design. We will create it in the part design only. So we need to create the geometrical shade here. And now we will create uh, this profile let's say on the top plane we will create select the circle and we will we'll, uh, take some approximate dimensions uh, let's say diameter is around 1000 mm so exit the workbench and extrude this again we will create a thousand by thousand so, so we will extrude by a thousand mm so now we will create a chamfer so with a chamfer command or you can create with a revolve cutout or group of group command so just select this to chamfer and uh, length uh, you consider around uh, 250 mm and click ok so maybe we need to just reduce it to uh, 210 now it is ok so let's provide some relates or if we will first create some groove here select this circle and we will project the fill out edges no need of this select this and this and make it tangent and take a radius let's say approximate uh, 50 mm we will change it later words okay if required again from this edge you can project this age as well or just pro better to provide the dimension from the axis system so let's say 550 so we will make this line as a construction and then exit the workbench select a circular pattern no, we'll first uh, by using the sharp command we will create a circular revolve so just select this uh, z axis here and click ok so we will pattern this like the rectangular pattern select the reference element uh, z axis in the reverse direction add this again approximately select this and keep it ok we will just reduce the diameter of that uh, let's say 20 or maybe I think 50 is ok
just add it to 30 mm. So now sketch on this plane. So just select, uh, let's say, project this edge here. So this circle, then make it a circle here. Let's say 600 mm. a rectangle over here similarly create a vertical rectangle which provide a dimension let's say 220 mm and here no need to provide a dimension similarly here provide 20 mm now just uh, erase the unwanted dimension so let let us erase this erase this erase this So you can just use this sketch analysis tool here. Oh, sketch uh, this is under constraint, so you can constrain. Sorry. So again, we will trim this. Just trim these unwanted entities. Trim this. So just check once again. Just erase it and so now it's create now the profile is created so just add some dimensions here a dimension to this line because uh, at the time of trimming it gets deleted the associative weight gets deleted so similarly select and delete this select this two dimension So now exit this, select a pad, go in the reverse direction and select, just preview it and click OK. So in this way the base is created, so now we will just add some feature over here so 
select uh, this is 500 then i will create one feature here let's say 480 or maybe 440 and again extrude this let us add 50 mm so this way uh, the tank is created and now with the shell command simply you can you can shell this uh, let's say see 7 or 6 mm consider we'll first add some fillets over here say 30 mm or we can just increase it to 40 let's add the fillets over here say 30 mm so maybe it is okay here it is going to affect the so maybe 5 mm so yeah 5 mm is okay let us add 5 mm just add this as a 10 mm and we will add multiple fillets here here and here just select okay similarly we will add the fillets to this space Here also the fillets are created. this wrong select this edge this edge this edge Share it now. Okay, we have made some mistake here. So let us go to the sketch. Select a normal view here. Let's delete that tangency like this circle and this line here and make it coincidence select a line and make that line continuous line and just delete this so it will get automatically updated Just select this uh, shell command. Let's provide this uh, radius as uh, 3m. 3m. 
So in this way, you can see uh, the hollow water tank is created. So now you can just add the material here. select uh, the material over here plastic material is not uh, showing here so just add a color to it let's go to the properties and just select this black color so in this way uh, the tank is created here add this different colors you can add you make this transparent is zero so in this way you can create this tank So thank you very much for watching and please like and subscribe my channel for more videos.